Hello Lightning's Prayer Force, Helen Unigard here. I am coming to you with my prayer team. Everybody say hello. hello. Woo! Even the youngest one, we got the youngest one here. Mighty warrior, Isaac Unigard. Say hello, Isaac. Hi. Say hi, hey, it was a warrior shout. Hi. Woo, that's right, good job, Isaac, good job. Well, we are, um, like, I, like I mentioned, I mentioned to some of the prayer, uh, Lightning Prayer Force group that we wanted you guys to feel a part. And uh, we're very excited today. We're actually on Highway 75 in Florida, and we are driving from Clearwater area, Tampa Bay, to Tallahassee. And then we're going to be driving the Prayer Walk America route. We have received a commission from the Lord an assignment added to added to our other assignments the assignment that we already have praying for america restoration of america assignment awakening america praying for uh the, the assignments that we've had president donald j trump hallelujah god has god has commissioned this the lightning's prayer force lightning's ministries to come in to come alongside Prayer Walk America, to add our stream, our anointing, along with their anointing, to come alongside, to, so that there would be an increase of power. When you have many streams coming together, you will have more power. And God is doing that, we believe, in the name of Jesus, with what he has commissioned this ministry to do concerning Prayer Walk America and their assignment. God has called us to, go, to, to drive, to prayer drive, to anoint, anoint this vehicle and release the anointing of God with our prayers and our decrees and our words of faith, applying the blood, holding the blood of Jesus, drawing the bloodline of the Lord Jesus Christ over these highways that uh, Pastor John and Sandy will walk and, and he will, every place is put treads, it is taken for God. Restoration and awakening for America shall come forth. Hallelujah. So we are adding our stream, our faith, our anointing, our love, our supply of the Spirit to their assignment in the name of Jesus. And we are doing this. I'm, I heard from the Lord. The Lord said, the Lord spoke to me so clearly. The very uh, We went to visit them and, you know, as they, when they were uh, down in lower Florida in the Clewiston area. We got to visit them. The Lord said, go, go see them. And we wanted to go and connect with them and, bless, and just be a blessing in any way. And we prayed with them. And within a few days, Pastor John contracted COVID. And uh, God really spoke to us to stay to stay just close to them and to be of any help and assistance during that time of trial and attack. And uh, it, it birthed this. It blossomed into, don't let go. I want you to go with them. I want you to go, I want you to go before them. I want you to go pray. Years ago, the Lord anointed, uh, anointed my life and told me, I want you to pray. I want you to pray. I want you to prayer drive. I, I never heard of it before. I want you to anoint the, the car and I want you to drive certain places I tell you to drive and I want you to decree the blood of Jesus and claim that, tor that territory for me. And, and, and the, I, I obeyed. And after the first uh, assignment that I was sent on to do that, I had a visitation. I was, I was, I was invaded by the presence of God. And I, I just, I just started weeping. I, I doubled over with the, under the power of God, and I saw the feet of Jesus, and I saw the oil of the Holy Spirit being poured out on His feet, just like it said in the bottle, in the Bible, when when the bottle of oil was poured on His feet, the al out of the, the alabaster box was poured on His feet. The oil was poured upon his feet. Mary poured the oil upon his feet. And he said to me, thank you for loving my city for me. I had that vision and I heard those words spoken right simultaneously with that vision. 
and I, I wept. I was just, I was undone. I was just overwhelmed by the presence of the Lord. He correlated driving and praying and releasing faith to pouring oil upon his feet and loving his people and his city for him. I was undone, but he did that to me for a reason, to release faith in my heart that you could do this. Do this for me too, along with the other things I've told you to do. Do this for me too. I, I waited on him, I prayed on it, and uh, it was made very clear and is still clear. So welcome to our journey. We want you to be a part of it. We're going to pray in the Holy Ghost, give decrees, make declarations. We're going to be doing many, many videos. And uh, we'll be sending it to those of you that are on our, our email list, the Lightning's Prayer Force. We'll be sending it to you, to your email, so you can feel encouraged. And no, you're not praying alone. You're praying with us. And, and when we pray together, you know, even you don't even have to pray at the same time and hour. You can take the video and just uh, just play it any time. Let it be an encouragement. Pray in the Spirit with it. Amen. And know that God is working. Hallelujah. Amen. Thank you, Jesus. Everybody, amen. say amen. Hallelujah. Amen. Thank you, Lord. Glory to God.